for you, baby. The tough way to rap. So just y'all listen up and don't give me no crap. Yeah? When a weak acid reacts with a strong basic solution, the stuff you gotta know without no confusion. So here's my invitation to a demonstration. Let me take you cruising through the calculation. You drop a line down from halfway up the steep bit. That's where your end point is. I don't give you no shit. <laughs> Work out moles of OH minus. At that point, you just measure. It's a bitch and piece of piss to do. No pressure. <laughs> This is a hydroxide times its concentration. This equals moles of acid as it's a neutralization. The acid's lost its proton. It's done an ionization. I like big burettes. I cannot. <laughs> they got a fascination. Then put moles of acid over volume from your pipette. Now you're kicking ass. You got the answer. No sweat. It's bad to the bone, the titration gangster rap. So just y'all listen up and don't give me no crap. If you ain't got a pH meter, you'll need an indicator. That'll give you the same equivalence point data. But you gotta choose one that changes color at the end point. Yeah, think about that, skanks, while you smoke it. <laughs> it changes color early or it changes later. Then, man, you chose yourself a freaking no good indicator. <laughs> now, focus on that nasty old Henderson Hasselbalch equation. Yo, sister, fix it firmly in your imagination. Those HH -H dudes will tell you where everything's at. They the cool niggas who put the pH in the <laughs> The ratio is one, log of one is zero. Hell, that term's just gone. So, the pKa is halfway to the equivalence place. It's the pH where the acid equals its conjugate base. And if you can't remember that, then in your face. <laughs> There's still some juice left in the titration curve wrap. So just listen up still, don't you give me no crap. Now, big ups for me for giving you all this information. This cracking explanation. It's a popping education. <laughs> if you want the pH at the start of the titration, believe me, bro, it's a fucking simple calculation. <laughs> <laughs> then, square root will give you H plus in moles per liter. Take the log, change the sign, fast as a cheetah. There's nothing neater, what could be sweeter? The pH at the end point is a weak base calculation. You need the KB of the conjugate times its concentration. Then OH minus is given by that term when it's been square rooted. But don't forget, at that point, the mixture's been diluted. You take my word for that, don't you dispute it. There, POH from 14 has got to be subtracted. Now you're crumping, you got the answer, holes, you cracked it. <laughs> now, all you homies in the hood, you know the titration gap. Pass your exam for shizzle, not no crap. Let this awesome chemistry infiltrate your brain. Parasite, man, it's off the chain. <laughs> Get your head round all these examples and do lots of others. Get off your fat asses, don't be lazy mothers. <laughs> if you want to get an A plus, you gotta give it some hammer. But if you want me to try, then screw you and your mama. <laughs> <laughs>